Welcome everyone to our webinar about Louise Hayes methods and the done for you workshops. And this is something that is so unique about our life coach training because most coach trainings don't give you workshops. And these are all ready for you and they provide a wonderful means for you to sign people up in a low investment of time and money and get to know you and then want to have coaching with you. My name is Dr. Patricia Crane. I was privileged to study with Louise Hay personally and kind of a long story we won't go in today. Um, it's on YouTube, but that evolved into her approving the training program. And with me today is our amazing panelist, Jane Matthews. Hi, Jane from the UK. Hi. Hi. And Jane's going to be one of our assistants in September. Um, she also has been a Heal Your Life workshop leader and then coach since 2006. So she has an amazing amount of experience with the workshops and coaching, and she's going to be sharing a lot with you. Also, we have Anna Milkic here, who is originally from Serbia, now living in the U.S., and she is also a longtime Heal Your Life workshop leader and coach, so welcome, Anna. Thank you. Christy Dixon, and Christy is our COO and has been with us for quite a number of years. She is also a workshop leader and life coach and has a unique online program to tell you about. And then my mm -hmm. partner at everything, Rick Nichols. Hello, Rick. <laughs> Who happens to Hello, also, everybody. He happens to Welcome. Thank you for too. joining us. <laughs> and together we have led over 100 workshops. I think I figured about 130, and most of them are the training workshops. So we'll be sharing a lot with you about that. Now, I like to start out with a reading from Louise Hay's book. Um, this is my original. It's head, held together with a rubber band. So, of course, I have a new one. But I'm going to invite you all to just take a nice deep breath. Wherever you are, if you can do so safely, I hope you're not in the car, don't close your eyes. Um, and just relax and really listen to Louise's wide, wise, wide world, wise words. In the infinity of life where I am, all is perfect, whole, and complete. I support myself and life supports me. I see evidence of the law working all around me and in every area of my life. I reinforce that which I learn in joyous ways. My day begins with gratitude and joy. I look forward with enthusiasm to the adventures of the day, knowing that in my life, all is good. I love who I am and all that I do. I am the living, loving, joyous expression of life. All is well in my world. And so it is. And you just stretch so and open your eyes. And Louise's words just make you feel so good, don't they? Mm. Like everything is all is well in my world. It's just, just quite amazing. Um, Christy's going to give you a link in the chat, chat that tells you this full story of, well, the first 14 minutes of the two-day workshop that Rick and I did. We also have a whole video about how the training actually started, and we'll include that as our follow-up email, okay? But one of the things that we know is that a lot of life coaches are struggling to attract clients. There are a lot of people studying as life coaches, a lot of programs these days, and ours really is unique because of the inclusion of the workshops. I'm going to actually go through all the materials that you get soon with a PowerPoint, but for right now, I'm going to go to Jane Matthews, who's going to tell you about her favorite workshop <laughs> and a little more about the leading other than that she's done. Jane. Thanks, Patricia. Um, my favorite uh, has to be the two-day workshop. You know, it's it's the one we learn how to lead, first of all, and it's an intensive that lasts for two days. And it takes people through all of Louise's principles and so on. Um, and And, it's quite remarkable how transformative it is for the people who participate. So I have to start with that because that's the one I love most of all. And I never come away having led it without feeling completely buoyed up, completely energized mm -hmm. by, you know, what we've all been through together. Mm -hmm. But actually, when I started out in 2006, um, I didn't have the confidence to lead a two day workshop. So I did the 10 week, which is part of um, what people will get when they do this training. And I did that from my home. 
that meant there wasn't a big investment in hiring rooms and so on. And for about four or five years, I had back-to-back -back groups in my own home. Um, and what was lovely about that was that because people were meeting every week for 10 weeks, they became really fast friends, a support group for each other. And I have to say that many, many people who did those 10 week groups and who've done the two two day workshop with me have gone on to ask for coaching. That's where most of my clients come from. Or people who've done those workshops recommend me as a coach to other people as well. But you also ask the favorite workshop um, amongst the ones we get. And I want to just make a mention of the um, short workshop we get on relationships. It's part of the 10 week anyway, but it stands alone as many of them do so that it can be run as a, as a, you know, a short two or three hour workshop. And it's absolutely fantastic because we, I remember somebody saying that relationships are our best teachers. It's where we learn the most <laughs> um, about ourselves and others. The, the bits learning about ourselves are the uncomfortable bits. Um, but I, you know, I have seen that one it's so deliver so many aha moments for people, and uh, they go away looking at relationships afresh. So it's a really satisfying one to do, and we teach what we need to learn. So every time I do it, I learn something myself about my relationships. <laughs> I know all the other teachers will say that too. That's great. And there's nothing more joyful or gratifying than seeing the aha looks on people's faces and the joy on their faces when they, you know, really get what they need in these workshops. So thank you, Jane. Okay. Now, one of the questions, and you touched on it, and I'm going to ask Anna more about her experiences with this, but um, I have often been told, oh, you know what, I don't know if I can speak to a group or talk. I've never talked in front of a group, and it's sort of scary to think about all that and leading a workshop. So Anna... Did you feel anxious in the beginning? And, and if so, how did you handle that and move through it? Because you've taught many, many workshops now. Yes, thank you, Patricia. Um, of course, I felt anxious. I was a very young woman, not even 30, I believe, at the time when I did my initial training. And I never spoke in front of the group before. Um, so not only that, but all the material was new, all the logistics, preparing workshop. It was kind of frustrated. But what kept me um, going was the enthusiasm and my um, my will to share what I've been through, what I experienced with um, other people. So I bet on a scale now, looking back on a scale um, that was on a higher level, my will to do this work versus the anxiety. And what helped me actually go through that was reading material over and over again. At the time, my first workshop was done among um, Serbian community, and I had to translate all the material from yeah. English to Serbian, which yeah. kept me reading it again, reading it, finding meaning in words, discovering emotions, right words. And that's what really got me to know the material. And once you know, once you know the material, you have all the possible questions and answers that show up in workshops. Okay. So I basically use my manual as my Bible. I would <laughs> okay. say it's very well, well structured to help go through the workshop the first time. And I remember when I finished that work, first work, workshop that evening, I thought I was, I was going to be so exhausted. And I said, oh, I wish I had a new one scheduled for tomorrow. I was so energized and <laughs> I was so excited to do it again. It was, it felt easy. Yeah. Oh, that's great. That's wonderful. Um, as I mentioned, Rick and I have led together uh, over a hundred workshops. And so um, Rick, on the two day workshop, what is it that uh, you as the leader, what do you experience guiding people through that? You're muted. Thank you. I was muted. What I experience in the two-day workshop as a leader of the workshop is the most amazing in-depth transformation with each individual in there, almost 100%, every time. Every time. It cannot fail. It is a process that is designed from the beginning, opening from the first day, 
to the closing on the second day to, uh, if you can imagine, being led by the hand by Louise Hay into an introduction to yourself. Uh, we were talking a moment ago about uh, relationships and improving that. I think, uh, was that Anna that you brought that up? It was great. Yes. And most of us don't have a very good relationship with ourselves. And the reason we don't have a good relationship with ourselves is because we're taught by society and by social conditioning and by the media uh, in, in every way imaginable, that we're not quite right. That there's something wrong with us. And in order to correct that, we try to berate ourselves and say, there you go again. You didn't do it right again, did you, Rich? No. Well, what about the other day? You didn't do that right either. When are you ever going to get things right? And that kind of thinking creates an adversarial relationship with the two parts of us. One is the self and one is the ego. And they tend to be always in battle. And what this what this two-day course does is it pulls them together in a room where everybody else is fighting that same internal battle, which by the way, is the toughest battle you will ever fight is the one with yourself. And we get to see everybody else coming to a new realization about who they really are. The ego, at a point, probably halfway through the first day of that two-day workshop, begins to sort of back away out of the room, hide in the corner somewhere because it's getting bruised here. And in, if any luck at all, it goes out the door and down the street and will never come back. So the beauty of it is uh, the leaders guide participants on a journey into themselves to find that beautiful spark of light that animates their body mind and reintroduce them to it. That's the beauty of it. And it happened, everybody here has led two-day workshops, and they have seen it. Mm -hmm. uh, and I, I thrill at listening to reports from our teachers that have graduated from the training uh, that have gone and led a two-day workshop, intellectually knowing the process and what's going on. But at the end of it, they actually see the results in the people that have attended their own two-day workshop whether it's a small group or a large group, they see enormous, enormous changes in people. They see joy in their eyes. They see laughter in their face. They see love in their hearts. And this big hug fest at the end of it. That's what I love about it. The unconditional love that is just, just develops out of the process. Anybody can do it. No matter who you are, you can teach a two-day workshop or any of the shorter ones. The most powerful is the two-day and you can see people transform before your very eyes. And there is no financial reward that could be nearly as great as the reward of seeing people heal. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Absolutely true. And Christy, um, you have led quite a few of our Journey to Self-Love shorter course, which is an online program that was actually developed in 2017 but it really took off during COVID. So that was part of the gift of COVID is some, I'll talk about that a little bit later and how we developed some new things then, but um, just share with us about the online journey to self love one, Christy. So this has been a really fantastic platform that we have created for our teachers where it combines the two things that people are often looking for as participants in your workshops. They want to be able to work on their own time, but they also want the community of being with other like-minded people who are working through the same things that they're working through. And what the learning portal, this journey to self-love that we've developed 
for our teachers does is allows your participants to work on their own. It's all set up for you. It has meditations, diary exercises, um, you know, all these different things that are set up for you and on five, based on five different modules, which are deserv deservability, love, prosperity, loving your body and honoring boundaries. And what your participants will do is they'll work on their own time. They'll go through the exercises in each module, but then you pull them back together through a Zoom or if it's a local community, you can even do it in person. And you go through that week's module together. And it has been an invaluable tool for people who are just beginning to come into Louise's work and just learning how to go onto that journey of self-discovery and self-love and self-acceptance. And it's also been invaluable for people who have been well versed in this work and who have been on the journey for a while they'll come back into a module like this and they'll think oh well i have loving my body under control i'm i totally good there i have done the work and then they'll find that nope there was something a little deeper i could get to and so no matter where anyone is at on their their journey of this self acceptance and self discovery they are able to come into this module and into this online learning platform and go even deeper or go into the introduction of it and then come together and really have a beautiful community and beautiful sharing and beautiful ahas. It's a it's an incredible platform. Yeah, great. Thanks so much, Christy. No, uh, one of the questions we often get is, especially when COVID was going on, uh, was about training in person. And we really had to go into a deep dive with ourselves about that. And what we realized was really to be true to Louise's legacy and to really take people on the journey that they need to go on to really learn more about themselves as Rick was talking about and really shed a lot of that own old stuff was we needed to maintain the training in person. But what we've done now with the workshop leader and the coach training, many of our trainers worldwide are doing those separately. In putting them together, we have what we call a hybrid program now. So we have three in-person Zoom meetings that are training ahead of the actual in-person, which this year in the U.S. is going to be in San Diego, September 25th to October 5th. And then we have post sessions as well. And we carry on with you for quite a long time because we don't wave you out the door and say, have a nice life. We are really committed in our hearts to Louise's legacy. And so we want to make sure that we follow up with you and support you as you're going out to do your workshops and also to do the life coaching. Now, I do wanna share a little bit more about the actual materials that you get because you've been hearing something about them. So I'm going to start a screen share right now. Here we go. Okay, so the workshop leader in life coach training with Louise Hayes methods, the materials you receive to make it, how to use up to 14 different workshops. And of course, we take you through a lot in terms of practice with the life coaching during the training in person and afterwards. And also you get a life coaching manual. So first of all, we've been talking about the two day workshop quite a bit. This was Louise Hayes signature workshop that she developed in the 1980s. And you may think that was quite a while ago, but I'll tell you what, we humans will always need help in body, mind, emotions, and spirit. So this workshop will be relevant forever. So you don't need to be concerned about it going out of style or anything like that. But that was her initial workshop that she was uh, put together when she was working with her initial groups. And it's called the Love Yourself, Heal Your Life Workshop. You get a full script, which has already been mentioned. And that helps people feel a lot more comfortable because you're not recreating the wheel. What you will do within the script is include some of your own experiences because people really respond to that. They wanna know how you changed and transformed as well as getting all the material from Louise. So a full script, there's music that goes along with it, there's handouts and there's social media graphics as well. Now this two day workshop does remain in person. Again, because it's the emotional depth of it and what you take people through, it's really important to have that one in person. Now, 
If you've never led a workshop before, we actually don't recommend that you start out with that one. And Jane was talking about how she did back-to-back 10-week workshops to begin with for quite some time. And I'll go into, just before I go into that, um, the first day of the two-day actually works well by itself. So some people start out just with that. It's also in person because that's an easier one to put together and just, you know, go through the script yourself and learn everything. The topics in that one are the nine principles of Louise's philosophy, like what you give out, you get back. The shoulds and coulds exercise, which is in her book, and everyone loves that one to find out what shoulds they've been living with all their life that they can get rid of. The body-mind connection, the inner child meditation, which is just a wonderful meditation and you know, experience of really connecting with what your child needs. The awareness exercise for negative messages. And that one also was really incredible because some of them have been lurking under the surface for a long time in that unconscious mind. People are amazed with what pops up then. And then of course, affirmations, because of course, Louise was called the queen of affirmations. And so Mm -hmm. there's a lot about affirmations in there. Then you also get a manual for the 10-week Love Yourself, Hear Your Life study group. Again, you get a complete script for in-person or online for this one. We did adapt this one to be online during COVID. And so you get materials for either one you want to do if you want it in person or online with handouts, music, social graphics. The first five weeks can actually be all by itself and then a second five weeks. So those are two more workshops. Um, Some people have told me that it's hard to get people to commit to 10 weeks these days, unfortunately. And so they've led them in two separate sections. Your trainees do need or your attendees do need to have done the first five weeks to do the second five weeks. But people do go on to that, you know, at a later time. So you can offer those separately as two additional workshops. And then the shorter workshops within the 10 week, and Jane was talking about this with the harmonious relationship section, each one of the modules in the 10 week study group, except the first one, because that's just really an introduction, you can lead completely on your own. And these are also either in person or online, whatever you choose. Prosperity consciousness. Well, that is usually one of the top things that people are interested in. Uh, Louise loved to talk about prosperity consciousness and help people change their minds about what they could really um, attract and really experience. The harmonious relationships one, not only with yourself and learning how other relationships mirror you and how you can learn how to love yourself more deeply, but also really how to love and approve of others, which really automatically almost comes, right, when you love and approve of yourself. The mind-body connection, again, there's a separate one on affirmations and inner child. So that's five of the nine that you can lead out of the 10-week study group. And then the other four are releasing negative messages, learning to love yourself, career and success, and anger and forgiveness. And the forgiveness part in, uh, in particular is just really so powerful because there's so much stuff that people have, not only about others, but about forgiving themselves. So it's really, that's a very important one. And then here's just an overview of the three manuals you get, the two-day workshop leader manual. Um, you actually get that one digitally after the training um, because it is quite a, quite a big manual. And so you'll see part of that during the program, but you'll get the entire thing as a digital download later. The 10-week study group, you do get that completely printed out with all of you know, your uh, scripts, you get a flash drive with your music, your social uh, media graphics and other kinds of things that are on there that will help you to get started um, with each one of the modules. We go throughout through that more fully at the training as well. And then finally, you get the life coach manual also. So you have quite a bit to take home in your suitcase and we encourage you to have some extra room when you come to the program. Okay. I'm going to stop this time share, the screen share. And Christy, if you would just tell people or put on the chat the next link that we had for the Calendly one-to-one session, if anyone wants one. But also, if you have any questions, just go ahead and put them in the chat. We're happy to answer any of your questions uh, as we go along. And I'm going to go back and just um, really talk to 
Let's see. Um, Anna, how about if you just share some more about just your experiences with the workshops and actually the coaching at this point too. Okay. So let me let me do the, the coaching first because I've I've done two days. Uh I haven't talked about it. And I uh I've done one day, but what what was my favorite was my affirmation Tuesdays. I will do every first Tuesday of the month okay. affirmation workshop that was I believe two or two and a half hours long. Um so I would always teach affirmations because for me it is a basic of Louise's work mm -hmm. and it touches negative beliefs and everything else. But then it would um the topic would be different affirmation Tuesdays, and then it will be either inner child and negative beliefs and prosperity. So that was really fun. And it, I had some people coming over and over again because they would hear the same story about affirmations, but then other things would be different. And it was just amazing experience. It um, kept me committed to it as well, not just them. Um, other than that, um, I've done um, I've done trainings. Um, people usually ask, I know that when I assist trainings, participants ask, where do you start? How do you work? Um, I connected with a lot of yoga and Pilates studios. I, um, I've done workshop for moms um, at a yoga studio. I've done uh, one Mother's Day um, in a hair salon. They called me over there. So they would sit basically on the, the yoga mats in a hair salon. It was for Mother's Day. It was beautiful. <laughs> so you can be as creative as you want. As Jane said, she did it at her home. There's a lot of opportunities. You don't have to rent a big place and start working. You can start from what you have. And online is always a good, as you said, um, option. Yeah. Now, and, uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, that's great because that actually is another thing we found that people who, number one, already have some other modality like Reiki or Pilates or yoga or something like that, you already have a group that knows and loves you. And so it's easier to get the workshop started, but we have also a lot of information on how to start gathering your groups. And then as Anna, as you're talking about, we have a lot of people who have connected with a yoga studio or a wellness center or a women's center or someplace like that to offer their workshops so that you're not just doing all the advertising on your own. You're actually, you know, working with another group. And I know Jane, you've done that as well with the weight loss program. You had a Groups. That's Did right. About that one, yeah, yeah. Um, the uh, the local surgery got in touch with me to because they'd heard that I was running, change your thinking, lose the weight, and um, and they got some funding and had me in to run some sessions over about a year. I had a number of groups there who would come, and uh, and I would work with them. And of course, it was Louise's principles. Mm -hmm. uh, but being introduced to people who had no connection or experience of Louise Hay at all. And that was very exciting, again, because some of those then came to other workshops down the line. I also got in touch with um, the Eating Disorders Group, and they had me uh, coming along to run the self-esteem workshops for them, self-belief workshop, which again is all based on Louise's principles of, of uh, letting go of this criticism and using affirmations to change our mindset. But the one I have to, I have to mention is Greece because um, one day about four years after I'd trained, I got a phone call out of the blue from somebody who'd found me online and found that I was running the Louise Hay workshops and invited me to go to her retreat in Greece and run the two day there. And I did that very happily for 10 years. So there's lots of opportunities to team up with other people and, and run workshops um, all over the place. Greece mm -hmm. sounds wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> I loved it. <laughs> well, and that's something else about the training and your certification and your licensure as well. You can teach anywhere, any place. Um, you can teach in other languages if you have, are bilingual or even many of our people are trilingual. We have many of the materials translated into other languages and you can also receive those if we have those particular ones in that language. So you can teach anywhere. If you have a group that you know of in another country or you're asked like Jane was to go to Greece, then you can certainly go and teach anywhere. So it is an international licensure, okay? Um, and I know, Rick, I want to ask you to just share some more, too, because 
really one of the things that you love to share about is how important this work is to the world. It's not just for us individually for a, you know, a career, which is wonderful and to help other people, but really the vibrations for the world. Ah, uh, yes. Um, the world needs this work right now very, very desperately. And I I won't go into all of the, the myriad of uh, awful things going on around the world that are getting worse. Somebody has to come in to try and 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 fix that. And the only thing I'm convinced, the only thing that will do it is love. And love starts with yourself. As I mentioned earlier, the most difficult relationship we have is the one with ourself, most of us. There are a few that have kind of gotten over that. But you learn to love yourself and forgive yourself for your for an entire past life. And once you love yourself and forgive yourself for everything in the past, that amounts to a forgiveness of yourself. That amounts to setting yourself free from all of that. And you learn something incredibly special right then and there. This is what is talked about with you know a certain kind of enlightenment. You realize that everything that you had been criticizing yourself for all your life uh, is the same thing that other people have been criticizing themselves for all their lives. So when you forgive yourself for all your criticisms of yourself in the past, and everybody else that has criticized you in the past, when you let that go and, 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 and forgive yourself, forgiveness is no longer necessary because you come to this amazing realization that everybody else is just like you and that they have been operating under a set of beliefs that are completely erroneous. They are false. They are wrong. doesn't mean that anybody had lied to you about it. It means what they were doing was projecting upon you what they felt about themselves and installed that belief within you. And then the media, mass media, social media, newspapers, all of it come along and reinforce it. So you can forgive all of that. You can say, oh, I got it. I didn't understand. I just, I did. I thought I was a bad person because somebody told me I was over and over again. So you let it go. You forgive yourself. And when you forgive yourself and let go of that, you have forgiven everybody. That, my dear ones, is the answer to peace in the world. And the worst tyrants that we can find out there now, and we don't have to look far to find them, are the ones that loathe themselves the most. That's why they act out the way that they do. And they have taken this, this shame and guilt thing on in such a big way that they have to build themselves up into an authoritarian program, a, a belief in themselves to control everybody so that everybody won't come and get them, won't attack them. That's their problem. They're afraid. They're afraid. So if we realize that these people are functioning in fear and functioning under the same kind of erroneous beliefs we've been functioning under, and we just discovered them and said, oh, bad, okay, then we can look at anybody, no matter how bad they seem to be, with a loving eye and a feeling of, oh, they just don't understand, and then move forward. And then if you can take that one little step further and teach it to others mm -hmm. and teach it to others, and they go home, they teach it to their families and this, and into their communities and their businesses and so forth. This is a love that begins to just feed itself and grow of its own. It's going to happen. It's just the sooner it happens, the better. When you think about it, Louise Hay's book is very likely the, the, the very best self-help book, most widely sold self-help book in the world, in the world, some 60 million copies and more. Why? You got to ask yourself, why is that? Because it works. It works. It, really, it, 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 it lets people understand that there's nothing really wrong with them other than some belief that they had and then the belief they can let go of. So I, I love you each and all. And I, I know that if you are listening to this, you have a desire, uh, probably, first of all, to heal the world. But you got to start right here. 
healing ourselves, healing our body and mind, and learning that we are a spark of divine creative potential, and that we are we are acting through our own personalities to bring that into the world. This program, even if you never want to go out and teach formally to anybody, will be the most enormous uh, healing that you have ever imagined. And if you go out there and you never do a workshop, a training, or anything, you will walk through the world with this radiating from you. You will smile at people. You will greet them with acceptance and love. And that changes the world in a big way. So that's what I got to say about that. <laughs> Thank you, Rick. And it's so true. Uh, we have so many people after the training who have get in touch with us and when we're doing our post-Zoom calls, et cetera, and say, you know, everybody's asking me, where have you been? You look so different. You know, did you go to some like uh, spa or something like that? And they say, no, I went to this place to learn to love myself. And they just have a glow about them that actually they do look younger. We could even say, hey, well, this is a rejuvenating program besides the learning to love yourself, which is so powerful for you for your entire life. And as Rick says, you know, people see the change in you. Your family will see the change, your coworkers, et cetera. And there's so many different ways that you can actually share the information. But it's not only that, it's there's an energetic that happens. And some of you I know on the spiritual path that are on this webinar and listening to our YouTube channel afterwards, of course, in Miracles says for every five minutes, you're in the light, which is really when you're connected with that greater self, a thousand minds open to the possibility of change. It doesn't say they did change. It just says the possibility. But that is also quite an amazing statement that just the internal work that you do for yourself is so powerful for other people. So we really encourage you to, you know, really consider if your heart's calling you to this training, you know, you can have an individual session with myself, you can email us, you can ask the panelists that are on here, their emails are going to be in uh, what we put on our YouTube and we'll send out after that as well. But it is amazing the transformations that happen. And Rick and I can really see this because we have been the leaders of this program for over 25 years now. And the more emotional and spiritual growth that we're seeing as time has gone on, we can really see that there is a whole transition that is happening from the beginning of the program. Christy has been at every single one since 2011. You're nodding your head, so you've seen that as well. So it's really much more about not just ourselves, but about that energy when you're sharing with other people and even beyond that. So yes, Christy, you were checking, uh, you know, nodding your head. So do you want to share something about that? Well, I was just thinking about that, that spark that gets ignited from attending the, the training, you know, and, and being there with like-minded people. It's, it's, People wonder, do I have the time for this? Do I have the energy? Do I have the money for this? Do I... This is going to be one of the best gifts you ever give yourself because it will ignite you. You will, you will be pampered in love and generosity and a beautiful location. <laughs> and you get so much out of it. And then you go home and maybe you start and you lead back-to-back -back workshops like Jane did. Maybe you start smaller and it's once a month or you start a meetup group, but no matter what and how you go about doing it, that spark that you've been looking for, that you've been waiting to feed into your soul, that will go with you every single time you lead a workshop or even if you're just going into your local grocery store and thinking, I am walking in with love and you smile at people and you smile at your cashier, it comes back to you and you're all lit up again. It's an amazing gift. Thank you. Thanks, Christy. On just a practical level, um, the venue we use is the Island Palms in um, San Diego. It's on an area called Shelter Island, which actually is not really an island, but that's what they call it. And there's a beautiful walk that is right by the water. 
Um, the rooms are lovely, the food is lovely. So it's really, it's a wonderful bit, uh, venue for us to use. And you really do feel like you are being pampered, which is wonderful. Now, I know also many of you who are on this call have probably already read most of the information, but uh, the cost, the investment for you, for your new career and for everything that we offer, the full investment is 6,895. That includes you know, all of the pre and post sessions, the 10 days of in-training, 10, 10 nights at this lovely hotel, all your lunches, some dinners, um, you have your breakfast on your own, but uh, all the experiences that we offer in the manuals, et cetera. However, we do have a $400 discount that's in place until May 31st. And because you're on this webinar, if you go to make your deposit, um, you can use the coupon code SD with capitals for San Diego, SD2024. Christy, you want to put that in the chat? Mm -hmm. Use your coupon code and you'll get an extra $100 off of your deposit. So the deposit already shows a $200 discount and the other 200 goes off the balance. But with that code, you can get an extra $100 off of your, um, off your deposit. So we'd really encourage you if you're interested in the training to do the deposit as soon as possible because we do have a lot of pre-activities for you, um, some bonus sessions to help you get started with things, some coaching sessions, et cetera, before we even get into more of the formal part of the training. So you can always email us again about it or ask for a cal calendar, you know, one-to-one -one session if you'd like. Um, a few other things, if there's any questions on the chat, we're happy to answer them. And if not, let's see. Um, one other thing I wanted to mention is that because of the energy of the training, and again, that's one of the reasons that we stay in person is because online is wonderful. There's a lot of great programs out there. We understand that. But we also have an incredible energy that just happens with the group and people leave feeling like they have a new family. You know, they've not only fallen in love with themselves, but the other people in the group and they just feel like now they have their real family in addition to any birth family that they may have had. So that's another aspect of how wonderful just the in-person is and to be able to hug each other in person as well, you know, which we couldn't do for quite a while. Now, we have an incredible admin team. Christy is in charge of that, um, and I'm going to have her talk a little bit about that. We also do have a licensing program bes besides the certification certificate that you get. Uh, we do have a licensing program with Hay House, and so that's been another um, just addition to the professionalism of the program, and it's we also are able to license you to use the copyrighted materials and the logo that has been trademarked worldwide. Okay, Christy. All right. So we, it's just like Patricia said, when you leave the training, you are not just sort of set free to wander on your own. <laughs> we have, um, you know, we're here to support you. And my wonderful uh, executive administrator, Michaela, and I, we work very, very hard to make sure that you feel well supported and that we're available by email. We worked diligently last year on a new uh, website that is a directory for our teachers and coaches. And it is professional and beautiful and is not only working beautifully, but continues to be something that we explore how we can make it work even better for you. We are here to make sure that you succeed in the way that you need support to help you succeed. And we're, we're gonna do that for you. And you can expect to have a live person answering you and holding your hand when needed. <laughs> A live person. Yes. <laughs> not, yes. Not a robot. <laughs> not a robot. <laughs> Although we're also working to find ways to get answers to you quicker through like an autofill for the, and that's something we we're not afraid of technology. We embrace it and we love it. And so we're working all the time to see how we can help support you through more technology. So we are looking at for the frequently asked questions where maybe, you know, you have to wait an hour or two for us to get back to you, you could get it like that. So we are always striving to make it easier for our teachers and our coaches. 
Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Christy. Um, we also, as part of the follow-up, besides the Zoom meetings, uh, we also have a Getting Started series that goes out that just gives you a little bit of an idea of what you can do every few days to get started after the training. Um, we have a private Facebook group for all our licensed people. And we do have Heal Your Life teachers in 70 countries. And, you know, a lot of it is because, as Rick was talking about, Louise's book just speaks to every culture. Every culture, people are not being taught to love themselves. They're being given a lot of shoulds and things like that. So 70 countries worldwide with the Heal Your Life teachers, just really amazing. We have 22 trainers besides Rick and I worldwide, most of them in languages other than English, including Serbia in Anna's original country, and Italian and French is on the way, Dutch, uh, and uh, let's see, uh, Saudi, 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 Saudi Arabia, Arabia. Arabic. Have, yes, so we've got just wonderful trainers in different parts of the world. Now, one of the things with the start of the program, when Louise approved it, it's with a hug and a handshake, and that was absolutely fine at the time, but as time went on, business was mm -hmm. changing, the social media, you know, things were just heating up, and expanding, et cetera. And so the trademark lawyer from Hay House contacted us and said, Hay House was going to be trading a number of terms that they were using, including Heal Your Life, which of course is connected with Louise for her book, You Can Heal Your Life. And would we like, Rick and I like to have a licensing program through our company with them. And of course we said, yes, that sounds wonderful. So that program started in 2009 with the licensure. Uh, there is a small yearly fee for that, $99 um, for the ongoing program. That includes all of your follow-up, including the workshop at no, your li listing on this workshop um, program at no extra cost. So Heal Your Life workshops, you can go on and see most of the teachers worldwide. This is a new, fairly new website. So some of the teachers are still getting on there, the workshop leaders and coaches, but you can see quite a few online on there and what you're profile could look like. And then we also have the Getting Started series, of course. And then also you're uh, licensed to be able to use the term Heal Your Life. Now, I know you'll see it other places, but our program is the official one. And you'll see the little R, you know, for the copyright over and over again. And also the copyrighted materials, you'll get able to do that. Now, in the U.S. and Canada, besides the licensing Hay House did require us to get a group license, a group insurance policy, and that policy is 150 a year. And actually, that's a very good deal because some of our teachers were paying up to 350 a year for their liability insurance before we got this group insurance. So that's required in the U.S. and Canada, and it's recommended. And we have special, you know, connections in other countries like the U.K. and Ireland, Australia. And in some countries, people don't sue each other. So we don't have a requirement for an insurance then. And as Rick was talking about, as this love goes worldwide, hey, that will change too, I'm sure. <laughs> right? That's another thing that we're certainly affirming for, to really people taking their own responsibility for the kinds of things that happen to them. All right. So we're coming to the close of our webinar at this point. I'm going to just ask our panelists for a few final words for you. And again, you can follow up with us by email, uh, by Calendly, however you'd like to follow up with us. We'll also be posting this on YouTube. And so you'll be able to see it again if you'd like to review it and get some more information. Okay. We just and were thrilled you were here. Yes. Patricia, did you want me to talk about the love, uh, the, the oh, love yourself? Right. I'm sorry. The journey, yes. the journey to self-love. Oh, we do have a special Special offer. Yes, yes. So uh, this is we. I talked to you earlier about the um, our portal for your journey to self love, and I'm calling this the Love Your Life Journey, and I'm going to share with you just a pretty. Well, actually, I will just tell you about it. Um, we are going to work through that. Uh, online portal over the course of five weeks, starting on April 25th. And that's on Friday mornings for five weeks from 9 a.m. to 10.30 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, 
normally to take this journey with me, it's $119. But for everybody on the webinar, it is going to be $94. And that discount will last until April 22nd. And if you do decide to sign up for the training, then we will take that $94 and put it towards your training because we don't want it to be an extra expense. But we do want you to be able to have an opportunity to experience Louise's work to see if this is the right path and the right journey for you. And Christy, I did make it possible for you to share. So I think you have a flyer or something to share. I do. There you go. There you go. So here's the information. And when we send out our follow-up email, you'll get the information in that follow-up email as well. And the QR code is right here. You can scan it right in. And I certainly look forward to sharing that journey with all of you. Okay. Yeah, I can include that in the follow-up. Okay. So they have a little more time to get the QR code. Yeah. QR codes, aren't they great? They are fantastic. <laughs> We're just starting to really use those effectively. So, okay. So Anna, closing closing words? Closing words. Um, well, if you're thinking about this thing and wondering if, if it's for you, <clears throat> I would say allow yourself, give yourself permission for a 10-day in-depth program where you're going to be finding a new, a lot of support, but first of all, being in touch with yourself without phone without going home mm -hmm. lunch um kids taking to school everything else that goes on a regular day and i remember for me the huge thing um coming back from uh my training was what's the real life is it the days that i'm living or the time that i had with myself during that week at the training so i would say you leave the training and you're forever changed and that's the biggest gift that you get. Thank you. Okay, Jane. Um, yeah, I would echo what Anna says. If you if you feel pulled, if you feel drawn towards this work, then it's for you. Then it's for you. You know, and I am forever grateful that I have had a new career out of it, had a completely new life direction out of it, and I love the work I do. But more than that, you know, I've been lucky enough to assist Patricia uh, with the UK trainings um, since 2015. And I have seen group after group go through and say at the end of it, when we have our roundup, you know, this was the best week of my life. Mm -hmm. So this will be one of the best 10 days of your life, really. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Christy. Um. All I can do really is just echo what Anna and, and Jane have said. It is an extraordinary 10 days. Um, the hybrid program allows you to experience it before and after. So your 10 days is, you know, magnified by that extra work. And you, this is, it is, it is a gift for yourself to grow. And it is a gift for everybody who will meet you after. For everybody in your life, your children, your significant others, your parents, your bosses, your colleagues, wherever you go, this is a gift for you and for the whole world. Thank you. Thanks, Rick. Um, I would say um, build it and they will come. That is a line, of course, in a very popular movie uh, where an ex-baseball player built a ball field uh, and invited the greatest baseball players in the world to come out there. People told him he was crazy. and uh, But he said that he had heard a message, build it and they will come. And so he built it anyway. And they all came out of the woodwork to play ball in that stadium. So I would say to you, don't worry about how, where, or why, or what you'll do afterwards. Simply build it. And once you've got it built, it will attract those whom you can help. And if the 
uh, if the cost of the course is giving you a bit of sticker shock, look around at other courses uh, of this of the same nature, um, personal development courses, healing courses. There's lots of them around and being facilitated by very well-known people. You will find that this is the best bargain in a certification workshop, um, which is backed by a major corporate house incorporated publisher approved by Louise Hay. It is, it is cheap at twice the price because it includes all of your lodging, most of your meals, 10 days plus online work front and back. You go away with a license and a, and a certificate to teach a number of different kinds of workshops and in this case, to be a coach. So if you're concerned with talking to people, to groups of people, sometimes that bothers people and I understand that. A coach does it one-on-one. -on -one. That's how Louise started. She started out as a coach. They didn't call it coaching <clears throat> in those days. They called it, she was a practitioner of a certain philosophy. But she started out one-to-one, -one, and then she got so busy one-to-one, -one, she had to go to larger groups in order to, in order to be able to um, help more people. So we often hear from people are talking about, yeah, you know, was, I'd love to do this, but I just don't know where the money's going to come from. I don't, I don't have the resources to do this. And I would say to that, if you're thinking that way, this philosophy says that when you set your sights on something and you build an affirmation around it, miraculous things happen. We just had a woman who was wrestling with how she's going to come to this course in September. And she was going back and forth talking to Patricia. And so she just said, okay, I'm going. I'm going to go. She goes home and her mother calls her and said she just got a check out of the blue from, what was it, Patricia? Some... Actually, she had closed a stock account that this um, person who's coming to the train didn't even know about. Her mom had closed one. And that was, and the amount was almost exactly what the course cost. Right. So don't be bothered about all of the logistics of the thing. If this is work for you to do, may or may not be, but if it is for you to do, you set your sights on and make a commitment to do it, and the resources will show up. That's the way this whole thing works. And uh, the world needs you and needs you desperately to get out there and if not teach directly, then to be the love you wish to see in the world. Be the peace you wish to see in the world. That by itself is enough. Thank you. I love you all. Thank you for joining us. So in closing, ask yourself, do you love Louise's work? Has it changed your life? And do you feel drawn and excited about thinking, yeah, I could help others change their lives? Then this training is for you. So we look forward to meeting you beforehand in, on Zoom again uh, as part of the training and then, of course, in person in San Diego. So take care, lots of love, and we look forward to hearing from you. Thanks for being on the webinar. Thank you to all the panelists. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.